Hello everyone, welcome back to another one of my videos, and today we are playing, I believe... My dear boy. Okay. Um, <laughs> I believe we are playing episode 3 of Red Dead Story Mode, of completing it. Um, we are basically where we left off, I don't exactly remember where we left off last time, I know that we had just moved to the Valentine camp, and that's where we are at. I had to replay the moving part of it though, because... Apparently, I didn't save it, but that's okay. Um, before I go ahead and play this and do a mission or whatever it is I'm gonna do, um, I just I just want to tell you guys I'm not gonna be posting as much anymore on here. I know I haven't posted in a good minute since my Sims 4 video. I'm not gonna be posting as much anymore. Um, not because I don't want to. It's more of because. I just started school, and I'm in high school now, so to me, I've always had high school to be, like, the big four years of how you do things and where you go, you know, basically, like, your life decisions, like, it all starts with high school. So, I'm going to be focusing a lot on my grades and my school more than I am what I do when I'm out of school and when I'm not in school. And just some hobbies that I like to do. Um, but I am going to try to post every weekend at least. At least one video every weekend. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. Um, but I cannot promise you guys anything. Because there are just going to be some. Because when school actually like gets started up. Like of course it's started. But for my, my school at least. It's always like the first week. Well, we have, like, first three days. It's always, like, kind of getting to know your teachers and maybe, like, one or three activities, but not very many activities and not really, like, graded. But this week on Tuesday, when it starts up again, it will, like, be the week of, like, where you're going to get work, you're going to get homework, you're going to get graded for things, you know. It's where school actually, like, starts. Um, so there is that. That, and I'm just, like, busy with life, y'all. <laughs> My life is pretty busy all the time, so, you know. But I am gonna try to get videos out there for y'all. Thank you guys so much for the followers, and thank you guys so much for this, like, blowing up my channel. It's unbelievable how, how much love you guys have shown me. Like, I literally, like, love, I love you guys so much, and I'm so grateful for you, so thank you so much. Anyways, let's get into today's video. Woo <laughs> woo! Dutch. We're free to plan our own futures once more. Can I walk away? You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. Okay. Well, you know, there's that. Um, mission. Now, I do know, like, all these missions. My horse needs to be ground really bad. I do know all these missions, so give me a minute. <coughs> oh my goodness. My, like, my voice don't like me today, uncle. Okay, yes. Okay, yeah, let's go into town. Why not? Um, There is a mission in town that I really want to do. I'm not going to give it away. For, just for the people who are, like, following along with me or the people who haven't played this game and just kind of want to see what this game is about. Because I know before I buy a game, I always, like, go and see if I'll actually like the game by, like, w watching YouTubers and stuff play the game. So. Yeah. Oh, wait. I should probably, like, get off my horse. I don't... Don't mind me. I'm pretty tired. <laughs> I stayed up a little too late last night. Oopsies. I did go to bed. I just... Stayed up pretty late, and my body just likes to wake up in the morning. So, <laughs> it's nice, Arthur. Work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Yeah, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. <sighs> <laughs> you gonna take the old man into town? You can take us too? Well, what you got planned? 
Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. <laughs> I literally you love Karen. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> Ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. It's been a minute since I played like actual story mode on Red Dead. I haven't played online in a minute either. I don't know. Red Dead Online can be like so annoying sometimes. It's just not cool. Because like I feel like lately the more I play, the more I realize how many more people there are. And and like people literally walk past you and like just like shoot you for no reason and it's like i get it it's the game but like i'll be sitting there trying to do something or like trying to figure out something and they just come over and shoot me and it's like dude i'm trying to do something leave me alone and then like they just keep coming back because they're, you're trying to do something so you're not paying attention anytime they come back and it's like yeah you can parley with them or whatever but it's still like annoying that you even have to do that <laughs> it's really annoying i love red dead online but it's annoying Just like oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Sure, no problem. Thanks. Oh. It's the white one over there. Uh, okay, it's up there. Oh, don't run from me, asshole. You can do it, easy there, easy. Easy, it's okay. Hello? My game just like not want to work. You're okay. A gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, Come on, let's go. To Valentine. <laughs> oh, now that horse is like in our way. You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother, there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart, a small one perhaps, hidden <laughs> deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Blizzards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. <laughs> to be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> What's up, Mr. Deer? like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. 
Take a good look around, ladies. Let's see what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. Stairs always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Believe it if I had to. What the hell is this about? <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, they like flinch over nothing. It's like I'm not gonna hit you, or maybe I just will because you're annoying. I swear I'm covering my mouth, guys. It might not sound like it, but I am. With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. Imagine Paris and Valentine. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. I love that's Uncle. Really. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. <laughs> Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Arthur is just like. Morning. He's just Arthur. Okay, he's just great. So, I love Arthur. What do you His... need? <laughs> Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. Um. Hell, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Oh, you're sticking ahead, ain't no. you? No. Why don't you pick out a cigar? A cigar. A cigar. Where's a cigar? What are you saying? Oh, you seem a little scattered, Arthur. Trust old uncle. Old stock list in the catalog here on the counter. Whiskey's on the top shelf. Here's the door. Okay, we're buying a cigar. We don't have much money, you're so. Done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. Great, uncle. I don't have any money to spend, so we're not going to spend any money. Okay. Here's Ooh. to your good health, my sir. <laughs> it's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. <clears throat> Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? what? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? Uh, I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. The way Arthur protects everyone there. in the gang Especially, that like, the girls. Not look ideal. It's just like, me. yes. Okay, Arthur is just the... He's just it. Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I had to. For some reason, I feel like I saw someone do that, but they didn't, like, get in trouble for it. That's why I did that. I'm like, what do you think? I got a gun in my hands, you ding dong. That's pretty stupid. Oh! Get your hands off me. Don't shoot anything this time. Let's point it at him. Get off her. 
Or what exactly? You wanna find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Oh. Hey. Thanks, Arthur. What was that all about? Just someone I used to know. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Can I help you, sir? Trouble now, please. Oh, get the hell out of here, will you? <laughs> Wrong room. If I can learn how to punch in this game again, dang. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him? Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank. Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. Opa, everything's okay up there? It's after you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Just following it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Sorry, I'm quiet. I just focus on the game. You have to help me. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. <clears throat> They're chasing me. I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. <laughs> now please pull me up. Please. Mm, no. Absolutely not. That's a good way to get stitched on, okay? We don't need no pink and pink or tins coming down here finding us, okay? Okay, we gotta go return this guy's horse. I do return the horse. I don't know why I return the horse, but I do. So don't judge me. Why don't you return the horse? Really, it's the real question. Hey, my horse! Am I glad to see you? Hello there, Here's Mr. your horse back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. Appreciate yep. it. Okay. And then the mission at the bar I'm gonna go do, cause, right, yes, yes, I'm pretty sure this is the right mission. And this mission, I don't know why, it's like one of my favorites, cause this is like how Arthur gets his whole reputation. Reputation, I can't talk. You guys know what I'm trying to say. 
and Valentine, and probably like one of the hardest. Yeah, I think this was like the one that I struggled with most. I got like most mad at when I first started playing this game. <laughs> it's fun. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. This mission well, isn't really hard. Toughest Teak Mountain Man. Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. <laughs> Arthur. <laughs> I love Arthur so much, dude. You got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey! hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it easy. Are you about to kiss that guy or punch him? We have our answer. <laughs> Arthur always gets like the big tough men that want to fight him, dude. Always the big tough men. But then again, Arthur would literally outstrengthen everyone and anyone in the game. Even at the end, he would have won, really, if you think about it. There he is! Dummy! Tommy, stay out of this! Come here, you little greaser! Well, that weren't nice. I was like, bruh, I gotta help with my fur. Leave me alone, man. <laughs> Go away. Punch him right in the back of the head, dude. Oh, I love this. <laughs> Watch this. Whee! <laughs> Out the window we go. Oh, I love this mission so much. Oh, yeah, Arthur, get it. You got this. I believe in you. The thing is, everyone... I don't want to say it because, like, right. I'll say it. What I'm just thinking. What you scared of? Not you, that's for sure, Big Tommy. Okay, I've done to beat this guy so many times. It's not even funny. I don't really use the block. Okay, Tommy almost killing almost ends up killing me every time, but I don't ever use the block. I don't know why I just don't. Does anyone else actually use the block? There we go. We got him now, bruh. Hey, come on, stop that. Stop, stop, please, please. Okay. The thing is, is everyone was like cheering Tommy on, Big Tommy on, to like kill Arthur. But when Arthur went to like kill Big Tommy in a fight, they were like, no, don't do that. Like, you're a bad man. Bro, Big Tommy a bad man. He tried to kill me. The like, it was self defense. Uh. <laughs> Stop. Come, sir. You won the fight like, already. See? Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see. Hello, Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. 
And Bill looking as well as can be? Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we stay foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned <laughs> up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What is I'm that? sorry, but that's just, like, so unfair to Bill. And Bill, like, still remains really loyal to him. Why? How? But, like, why? Okay, I gotta go, like, get my horse. My horse is far away, because, you know. I don't... Hello there. No, why I decided to return the horse because now I'm rerunning. Of course, I could like steal another horse, but I'll just grab my own horse until like we actually unlock the stables and stuff because it's just easier when you have the stables and other stuff. Every time. <laughs> I have like no bonding relationship with my horse, so I doubt that it's actually going to come to me unless I'm like right next to the freaking camp. This guy probably thinks he was trying to rob him. Like, what the hell are you doing, bruh? <laughs> Going on a jog for my best friend. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I just kind of go in the direction of it. There are gonna be like videos where I probably won't like be doing missions a lot or like I won't do a mission or a video just be like messing around and stuff making people mad because that's what I do. Arthur's like I'm done man. Oh hey look there's a deer. I would shoot it but um one I probably don't get a good enough gun and two my horse is like so far away from me. But we're like, yeah, we're like literally right down the road from the camp, too. Oh, I know we're not, okay. We're near the camp, though. Yeah, the camp's literally right there. Okay, let's see what other missions we have, and then it'll probably be the last mission. Hold up one minute. Okay, only 29 minutes, so... Um... This is the hunting one, Kieran. Oh boy. Well, this 
like this one down okay so all of these actually take a good minute we could like go do the bounty do we want to go to the bounty right now i'm trying to think does it take long for the first bounty i think it's more of like the rat i don't know i think i'm just gonna go ahead and end the video here because i don't want anything to like take really long and i've already done two missions and i'm really tired and i have more to do than what i am now i should have got started at things when i woke up this morning but just didn't and the things that i did do before i recorded weren't very productive i mean they were they helped but you know um so i'm just gonna go ahead and end the video here with arthur and his horse and i realized that i love Arthur's hat at the bar, but it'll be on my horse, so it'll be fine. Anyways, guys, if you guys like this video, go ahead and subscribe. Also, if you guys want to see me playing games like um, Call of Duty, two plus two, <laughs> I'm trying to think. Hold on. No, it's not coming to me. GTA, maybe, possibly. I haven't, like, decided on that one yet. Is that really all the games I have? I ha I've played a lot of games. I just don't have a lot of games. But if you guys wanted to see... I know Call of Duty is going to be one of the games I play on my membership. It's only $1.99. And if you guys cannot afford the membership, go ahead and give me a thanks. You can, like, pause the video and then buy that red line. It's, like, the heart with, like, the money thing. Go get me one of those because, you know... I need inspired change. <laughs> if you guys can, do not worry about it. You guys, you guys are watching me and subscribing to me it helps me so much. Anyways, boy, guys.